Hello everyone, you all guys are listening to me on an academy online platform. This topic is connecting with the recently launch in the Indore uh, by our Honorable Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi to a Govardhan plant and especially what is the Govardhan plant and what about the initiatives that all the discussion I'll explain with you. This topic is connected with the science and tech and somehow it is also connected with the environment and you people know very well regarding all the science tech and environment based current updates. Those are relevant for your coming year examinations for civil service exams. I prepared for all of you and share on the On Academy YouTube platform. There's a lesson number 43 and here I'm going to start with you this topic. Before going to start the lesson, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Dr. Ravi Agrari. I've done my PhD from IIT Delhi. I'm working as a director of Purvanchal at Gorakhpur, Uttar Pradesh, where I'm providing you face-to-face -face classes with all the Delhi based team. I'm taking your classes for science tech and environment from last 18 years I'm taking classes for civil services examination thousand plus selection already happened in this examinations two books are fine published on the micro hill the one is on science and tech and second is the environment this is a highly recommended book for all of you for civil services examinations my telegram channel is c.me oblique ravi upsc underscore and academy here you can find out my all the pdf and a part of this my all the video link I also share here my academy profile is anacademy.com oblique at delta ravi pegari 2010 here people can connect with me regarding my all the classes those i'm taking in the live sessions my code is ravi upsc during joining any class if you use it you will get extra 10 percent fees discount in your courses india's best educator for upsc csc they all are available on academy they are taking the live sessions so it's a great opportunity to all of you to connect with all the experienced faculties for upsc csc at an academy an Academy All India Prelims Mock Test is going to organize on 24th April 2020-2022 and I'll advise to all of you kindly go and join us guys if you stay you are staying in the Delhi and nearby areas. This test is an offline test here you will feel literally like in the examination hall what about the condition what about the pressure here you will you will go and fill up the, all the OMR sheet everything you will feel as like a you are in the inter, in you are in the examination hall and the examination center is Old Rajendranagar Mukherjee Nagar both and my code is Ravi UPSC. You, anywhere you want to join, the you people use it. Code guys. An Academy is even launched a prelims practice booklet for all of you. Here the cost is 7,500 rupees and 10,000 plus questions also given there. This booklet even launched on the 20th April 2020. This for limited peer offer. If you are purchasing the one year above plus subscription icon is subscription between 20 April to 25th. So you will get this booklet freely. Neither you must have to pay for 10 booklet at least 7,500 rupees. CSC Assure and Academy is providing if you are taking a courses for two years and have a subscriptions. So on the basis of your uh, uh, admit cards, we are also helping you for the extra uh, coming year if you want more and more classes on an academy and connect with all the teachers. So here for this 10% extra fees discount, you must have to use a Ravi UPSC. I'll advise you the CSC Assure courses for all of you. An Academy Light Prelims Test Series 2020-22 and 2023. An Academy is providing you 55,000 plus enrollment already happened this course is valid for six months subscription and 12 month subscriptions a free and comprehensive interview guidance program for upsc csc 2020-21 is running now and here if anybody is eligible for this interview so this is free for all the eligible aspirants so kindly stay tuned with the academy for this interview guidance program so now finally i came here into the discussion of govardhan plants in the science and technology related article and this is the recent update guys like uh, Pradhan Mantri Shri Narendra Modi ji inaugurated a municipal solid waste based Govardhan plant in Indore. So what is this Govardhan plant in Indore every purposes I will discuss with you and definitely the Govardhan plant is very old concepts and you people know very well the Gobar and Dhan. So dung and money both are connecting together in this plant system. Actually this uh, project was launched under the Swaksh Bharat mission SVM Urban 2.0. Again, I repeat, Swaksh Bharat Mission Urban 2.0. Here, in this case, Modi ji launched this, launched this uh, Govardhan plant scheme. Overall, the vision of creating the garbage-free cities. The indoor cities where it is launched, to totally even indoor maximum time you will get as a, on the basis of uh, cleanless and or got up, rank 1 in India. So, this is the Swaksh Bharat Mission Urban 2.0 is being implemented. And the purpose of the principle is the waste to wealth. Ultimately, those waste, those waste are going to generate in this indoor area. Now it will be utilized for the wealth, money and for the improvement of uh, many other purposes also. And even a part of the waste of wealth, guys, the principle of waste to wealth, even also the circular economy. 
okay in this way guys we will do the utilizing we will, we will utilize the more more and more resources and we do its recovery and the result of it guys like one side we are doing the uh, solving the problem of sanitation we are we are and second side we uh, and one side uh, we are doing it second side we are we are generating the energy sources like cng type of thing so biogas system based cng generation is the motive of the plant also this plant capacity will be have to treat around 5 550 ton per day okay this plant has a capacity of 550 ton per day organic waste it will it will it will what decompose and here here 550 ton per day about the capacity of the plant is to segregate the wet organic waste and around 17000 kg per day it will generate the cng guys and a part of this so 550 ton to per day you will use the organic waste inside the plant and here with the help of the organic plant around 17000 kg per day of cng production happen and side by side 100 ton per day organic compost as a fertilizer you will also also develop that is totally organic farming and here the plant is based on zero landfill model guys ultimately here here there is no rejection option here guys whatever you will generate cng you know as a source of energy organic waste as a fertilizer and side by side you are going to resolve the problem of organic waste in that particular area in that way guys because of this project have a multiple environmental benefits you can see in this cases however there is no emission of greenhouse gases it is totally based on the green energy reason those methane generation happen the cng has a methane generation and methane is a gaseous nature of fuel and gaseous nature of fuel consider as a green fuel as i spoken you many times in my static classes also and this is the reason guys whenever in delhi have a odd event uh, uh even kejriwal government launch so kejriwal government never create any restrictions on the lpg and cng cng vehicle guys only petrol diesel vehicle you follow the odd and even guys not any other and a part of this guys along with the organic compost as fertilizer also generate in this cases actually indoor clean energy private limited a special purpose vehicle created to implement the project and here for that purposes you just see guys indoor clean energy private limited uh, it was set up by the indoor municipal corporation indo Invarmo, uh, enviro integrated solution limited so indoor clean energy private limited even set up with the by indoor municipal corporation indo Invarmo integrated solution limited and uh, it will work under the public private partnership public private partnership means public and private sector both will be invest here in this case but in the beginning guys that IEISL -E -E means Indo Invaro Integrated Solution Limited is already given all the 100% capital investment for this project around 150 crore okay 100% capital investment of 150 crore is given by IEISL this time in the beginning guys Indore Municipal Corporation will purchase around 50% of the CNG that will produce in this plant Okay, and with the help of the 50% of uh, CNG that the Indore Municipal Corporation will purchase, around 400 city buses of the CNG will run in the entire Indore, guys, with the help of it. And rest of the other 50%, it will be it will be purchased by the other private sectors, the other people. Okay, so rest of the balance CNG will be sold to the open open market directly, guys. And yes, of course, guys, the chemical fertilizer we are totally going to replace with the help of organic compost. So somehow it will be agriculture and horticultural purposes, it will be good. So ultimately no chemicals. Actually in the case of SBM U.2, SBM U.2 is what? That is a Swaksh Bharat Mission Urban 2.0. Swaksh Bharat Mission Urban 2.0, what is here? It is a second phase of SBM U, SBM U announced in the budget of 2021-2022 it will work for the five years it will work for the five year and for that purposes government is going to outlay of 2021 to 2026 1.41 lakh crore my god it's a great huge amount of money that will that will that will invest in the in the in the case of sbmu 2.0 what about the benefit of Govardhan scheme? See guys, Govardhan scheme will help in managing a major portion of solid waste those are generating into the village. What kind of solid waste those are generating into the village? Cattle dung is very common guys, a part of lot of the agricultural waste. And through the help of the cattle dung and agricultural waste, here we are promoting the environmental sanitations. In this cases of Govardhan scheme guys, it will, it will reduce the vector bond diseases and promote the public health. Okay, a part of other guys for the household purposes, we people are doing the burning of burning of uh, uh, woods and a part of this burning of LPGs. Through the help of biogas system, ultimately we will conserve the lot of LPGs and we will also not do the burning of wood. Ultimately, environment will save. 
it will also help to generating the organic manure many times i told you guys fertilizer uh, it will also promote the employment as a biogas system income generations here there is no carbon emission uh, uh, carbon emission and here we will also do the reduction of the import of natural gases from the foreign countries reason somehow we are going to generate the gases through the help of artificial means in the govardhan plants this is the biogas picture and here in the biogas picture i'll try to show you this is the entire biogas system this is the entire biogas system in this biogas system here you are going to use cow dung dung and plus water guys dung and water you just put it into the 50s to 50 ratio suppose 50 kg of dung around 50 liter of water so it's a call as a 50s to 50 ratio and when you mix up the dung and the water properly then it will call as a slurry guys slurry so now here you put the slurry and slurry is going directly into the tank into the tank this tank is totally covered guys this is totally covered so when totally covered the oxygen supply is not there this is totally closed and one thing more guys within the dung have a presence of organic waste you must be clear dung have a presence of organic waste and plus dung have also presence of bacteria and bacteria is maximum what mostly they are anaerobic in nature so dung and water when mixed up here inside so inside have a organic base and bacteria both see these two are inside the here container and bacteria is anaerobic when it is container is totally closed this bacteria start to decompose the organic waste inside the container here in anaerobic condition and here a kind of fermentation process happen anaerobic respiration process happen in this case have some gas formation happen and this gas outlet is here guys and after after decomposition of organic waste it will become as a fertilizer and fertilizer is very light in weight so slowly gradually slowly gradually it will start to uplift 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 and this is the manure guys this manure we can use as use in the fertilizer as a fertilizer okay again further you will mix up the put the slurry again again decompose again the uh, manure will become light in weight okay and this manure will again come out in that way we will do the processor process and here those gases generate here have a lot of gases and one of the very common gas those have a burning ability we can use for cooking purposes and all this is methane yeah this methane we can use in as as a as a as you as for cooking purposes stove purposes or you people can use it for as a cng in inside a vehicle guys to run your to run your vehicle in that way we can use it it is very very common what about the working of biogas plant ultimately I already have explained everything in the case of working of biogas plant we are taking our organic waste putting it to the digester with the help of microorganism anaerobic bacteria methane gas formation happen I already explain you everything in this container biogas system and the waste is going to convert into what biogas biogas have a methane as a natural uh, methane type of fuels and bio fertilizer you know very well as 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 a manure type of thing that i already have shown you even in the case of biogas formation guys any kind of organic waste generally we can use it where the bacteria can do their own role guys a specific ph and temperature is required for the biogas productions renewable it is an alternative of the renewable energy type renewable energy alternatives and biogas is a, also the kind of natural gases okay in a way that is a renewable energy sources produced are biologically through anaerobic digestion process and in the case of a fossil fuel those are produced geological process inside the earth because of fossils here it is totally opposite it is an anaerobic digestion process happen petrol diesel is generating through fossil fuel inside the rocks geological process but here every process we are doing in the presence of uh, presence of bacteria so it's for everything about this uh, biogas plant that was inaugurated in the uh, indoor the most most uh, cleanest city in the india is rank one many times three four three four times yes continuously it got a rank one awards there's a telegram channel that i'll advise to all of you regarding all the pdf people can connect with me here and uh, a part of all the video links i also shared here my unacademy profile is unacademy.com applicant editor ravi p agrady here you can find out my all the live sessions and my code is ravi upsc during joining any course if you use it you will get extra 10 percent fees discount here Iconi subscriptions, Iconi subscription uh, even available on an academy and here I'll advise to all of you guys kindly go and join the uh, uh, Iconi subscription. Here we will give a mentorship and here mentorship will connect with you under the live sessions. Regarding any kind of doubts a mentor will connect with you guys. Reason many of the persons have a, no one in your surroundings to guide you properly. So somehow a mentor will help you at every corner of your preparations. Here you will get the question answer practices also with the mentor study planning how to do what to do i have spoken you many times and here's a part of this open house with the educators you can also connect 
an academy subscription as a plus and icony both are available any courses if you want to for the general studies you can go but again i'll speak as iconic is the best one either for general studies or the optional if you are want to join any courses so kindly use the ravi upsc extra 10% fees discount we will get it upsc csc combat for csat special is going to organize on 24th april 2020 22 and i'll advise to everyone guys don't miss this the reason csat is most important part of your examination most of the people even not going to qualify mostly due to due to due to due to the problem of csat and whenever you are going to use it uh, join it ravi upsc code kindly use it in this case of joining 0% emi facilities and academy is also giving you as per loan facilities if anybody have a financial crunch so an academy is helping you under this loan facilities my coaches of science tech environment are running now in the plus if you if you want to listen my classes so you people can join my courses on the plus and my code is ravi upsc during joining courses you can use it upsc csc batches is going to start right now from 27th april 2020 22 here we are providing with the bilingual batches for Uh, 2023 in one year and two year both two courses are available and here we are also providing you 20 gs booklets and the to connect with this all the uh, classes and all you people contact uh, 8585858585 85. and why you choose an academy to crack is because of learners lovers have a beautiful response with an academies we are the best in the class educators best in the class learner rating best in the class test rating learners enrolled in the test 55000 plus it is a massive and massive crowd those even love our test series as guys and who what makes us the difference about the printed comprehensive notes interview guidance program daily answer writing practices and live mentorship everything we are providing at one places so thank you everyone to so listen me kindly subscribe the channel uh, like and share this video to all the serious aspirant and this pdf you go and download from the telegram group so thank you everyone god bless you take care bye